Hey everybody, I wanted to share some of the things that I picked up today. Um, I went to Wegmans for a few things for the house and I went in their um, makeup section and found a few things I wanted to share with you guys and i seen quite a bit of you guys um, haul the e.l.f. products so this is my very first time ever buying um, an e.l.f. product so I figured I'd share them with you. And these are the new, I guess they're new, um, or at least new to me. Um, these are makeup remover cleansing cloths, and you get 20 of them. And these were only three bucks, so I'm going to try those out. And then I already opened this. Um, this is, I haven't tried it yet, though, um, a moisturizing lipstick. And I believe the name is Party in the Buff color. It's kind of like a pinkish color. Um, it does say it's a new product. You know, I can't even, it's not even focusing in, my, my, um, light, look at that, sorry about that guys, it's like so freaking bright, you can't even see, so, this is the lipstick, is it on the right way, I'm going to take it off, I wish I can do a, uh, little, what do you call it, swash, swash, swipe, whatever you guys call it, yeah, I know, I sound like an idiot, don't I, but I'm only using one hand, so, it's a real, like kind of nudish pinkish color so when I um, do these use these products I'll definitely give you guys a review on them or maybe you guys tried them you can give me a little review and tell me what you guys think and then so at my store they have like a whole um, like a square shelving unit of all elf stuff and they have tons of stuff and it's so cheap um, and this is a new product, and this is Smugged Pot um, Cruise and Chick Long Lasting Eyeshadow and Eyeliner. I don't, I think I would use this for um, eyeshadow. It's a really pretty uh, nudish, brownish, goldish color, if that makes sense. Um, they had another color too, it was much darker, so I figured I'd try this one. And then, of course, um, just black eyeliner. Um, this is like a must-have um, for me. I definitely use um, eyeliner and mascara. Some, you know, I'm being a little bit more open since I watch your guys' videos. Um, and then I got some Wet n Wild products. And this is just a very small um, eyeshadow, and it's called Sugar. So I'm going to try that one out. And they also had, sorry guys, um nutty color which I really like this color I thought that was pretty and these were only 99 cents so I got that and then I bought some of their nail polish today and this is the wet n wild mega last um, let's see what this name is and this is called undercover it's kind of like a pinkish mauveish kind of color different and I like different um, I'll definitely paint my toes uh, this color I wear flip-flops all summer so I got that one and then they, I don't know the name of this because I can't see it because it's so glittery and I don't have my glasses up here. But it's just like, a, um, and I guess it's new from Wet n Wild. Um, let me see if I can see it, this one, because it is too sparkly. So these ones are called Wild Shine. Um, and this, what is this name? Tingle Pink, or Tickle Pink, excuse me. So I thought that was really pretty, really soft, pinkish color. Um... Yeah, I still can't see the name of this one. I don't have my glasses. I should have brought them up. And then this is Sally Hansen Gel Nail Polish. I never use the gel. Um, and this is a little pricey for me. I uh, usually stick with um, like a dollar or three dollar nail polishes. Um, so I really want to try the uh, gel one though. And I love, love, love this color. And this one is called, what are you called? Mad Woman. Isn't that like a really pretty color, especially on my toes? Yeah. So I got that, and this was actually like $8.99, and I got it on sale for six, I don't know, six something, six forty nine or So I got that to try that. And then I also bought a few more little products that is non-makeup related. Um, I've been collecting stickers just recently because um, I want to start doing some crafty things and scrapbooking and... All the other stuff so I did get some stickers there on sale they were only 50 cents and I'll show you them so I got a bunch of them I need some room 
So these are just like 3D um, stickers. Little flowers. This one says sisters. It has a little cell phone, a heart, and a uh, key. Little doggy print. And this one is more like a water park um, sticker. And some of them I got double in case if there's anybody watching my videos and you do scrapbooking and you'd be interested in doing a swap or trading, let me know. So I got two of those ones, and then this one is more like the beach. Really cute. More, I got that one. I got a double of this one. I thought these were really pretty, and I don't know why I got three of them, because I wanted two of them. But they're little angels with crosses, a little doggy print, and a bird. And this is a park one. Oh, park. I thought the sandbox was super cute. And then scuba diver. More um, angels. Yeah, I got three of those. I don't know why. And then I got this one. So I did get doubles um, just in case if there's anybody out there. Yep. And then I just got these ones. I thought these were really cute. Um, these weren't on sale. These were three or uh, $4, $3.99. But if you see, it's like the... Um, dress up Hello Kitty stickers and I thought the ones on the right were really cute so it's basically dress up ones but I thought those are really pretty sticker pad block auto collect and 10 sheets so I got those too and then these are non um, sticker related um, but I thought these were really cute these are like a little apron notepad and it has a little hanger on it isn't that cute something different so I got this one with the little cupcakes it comes with 70 sheets and then I also got this one that says kiss the cook with little um kisses on it oh cute and then I just got some soaps um I need to try new soaps for my daughter so I tried this one I haven't tried it yet but I got it Cheerio butter milk and this is um extra gentle um, dermatologist tested so this smells so good guys and this was only 69 cents so I'm gonna try this one and I got one more and this one is the oatmeal almond which is all oh, that smells so good and um this is for gentle uh, skin which um, my husband has really sensitive skin um, so I got those two smells so good guys and I think that is about it. I also have, um, and I'll probably do another video. I have a ton of brand new nail polishes um, I'll share with you guys. And another day, I don't want to make this video super long because um, then it won't download on YouTube. So there you guys go. And I want to uh, say thank you to the ladies. Um, that uh, Actually, the very first person I um, watched... Um, Showing the e.l.f. products was No Guts, No Glory. She's one of my subscribers, and she's awesome. So she was the very first person that kind of introduced me, anyway, um, to the e.l.f. products. So thank you, and thank you, ladies. All right, well, if you have any questions, um, you want to share anything with me, comment below. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye.